We're here, Dal Rantone, Mingila for our Athlete of the Week. Today we have multi-sport athlete Kai Akamoto from FD. Paul? Hey, Kai, congratulations on your selection of the Dial Rantone Athlete of the Week. Uh, who would you like to donate this check to? I'll be donating this check to Fee 25 to benefit the uh, less fortunate children and students in the Philippines. Congratulations on your recent signing to McAllister College. You're going to be taking your football talents there. What do you know about their football program and their style of offense out there? Uh, well, out there, and I think this can be true for all colleges, it's more pass-oriented, a lot more than what we're used to here on Guam. So um, I see a lot more um, of my blocking skills being utilized out there. But as far as you know, being familiar with their offensive schemes, I think I'm being introduced to a, a whole new world of football, and I'm really excited for it. You're leaving behind a football legacy with the Father Juanius Friars, 30 plus consecutive wins, beating the previous record set by uh, the GW Geckos. Yes, um, I'm really honored to be a part of that, but none of that would have been a uh, possibility without our coach and our, our uh, football program out there, Coach Keone Badua and Coach uh, Bruce Menno. Both have been very in, uh, integral parts of our success. And also all the other players from uh, class of 2016, class of 2017, all of them have contributed to that uh, record, and we were just fortunate enough to like, cap it off, and I'm really proud of being a part of that legacy. You also play rugby and baseball. Any chance of you continuing those sports out there in Minnesota? Um, well, baseball is a very big sport, I think, out there in the States, and this, the precedent for, for baseball is a lot higher. Uh, rugby, actually, in the States, from my understanding, is not as well known and not as popular as it is on Guam, but I'm, I'm definitely be on the lookout. It's not something that I'm, I'd be uh, straying away from. And I've come to play rugby this year, just my first year, but um, I've really come to love it and grown a passion for it. So who knows, um, maybe I'll take it up. With the recent passing of Mr. Tony Thompson at FD, uh, what are you going to remember most about uh, Mr. Thompson? Uh, Mr. Tony Thompson, he was uh, just a great overall leader. And he, um, he just believed in every single person that he was a part of the lives of and I think um, he really was an influential part in me not only being you know an athlete and a, a leader on the field but also a leader in the classroom and leader in all aspects of my life and he really pushed me to be great and also really just a very caring man and we're all going to miss him dearly. All right congratulations stay tuned to our next Dar Tone Athlete of the Week. KUAM Sports Athlete of the Week is brought to you by Academy Cougar rugby player Ali Ada signed her letter of intent to play rugby for Dartmouth College yesterday afternoon. The signing was held at the Governor's Conference Room in Adeloupe. Ali will be playing Division I rugby for the Big Green located in New Hampshire. The school is big on the sport. Along with academics, Ada thanked her parents, coaches, family, and friends in attendance. She leaves Island August 13th to get settled in at the prestigious Ivy League school.